Hello guys, and we're back with another video on Python GUI. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to add menu options or a menu bar onto our Notepad alternative. So, um, in the last video, we created was this lovely text editor here where we can type, and pretty much it's that's, that's just pretty much you can do. But now we're going to be actually adding some menus. Um, some menus, um, so we can actually have some functionality. So let's open up the notepad here. So we're going to be adding stuff like new, open, and save, and yeah, stuff like what the notepad here has as well. So let's uh, let's begin over here. We're going to start. With, these are going to be the menu options, and what we're going to do is we're going to say menu equals menu root. And what we're also going to say is root.config menu equals menu. And then we're going to add this file menu. I'll go over this later. Add this file menu equals menu. I'm going to add over here file menu dot add uh, cascade sorry menu dot add cascade is it here label file and that just gives the name then we're going to say over here file menu dot add Command. I'm going to save it here. Oh, label equals file. Let's run this. Not file. New. Let's run this. When we're running this, here, we've got here file. But it's not doing anything. Okay. Um, oh. We've got to save here. Menu equals, menu equals file menu. So, that should not work. There we go, new. So, let, let's break down through this code. So we're saying over here, that we want to create a menu variable, which takes in, which takes in the, so we want to create a new menu object. Uh, we're then going to say, okay, now in the root config, we're going to say menu equals menu. That, 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 that just says when we are referring to menu, we, we are referring to this variable in the root config. So we're saying a bit, so we put in a menu into the root, but then we're saying, okay, whenever we reference menu, we are just saying that we want the menu which we've placed over here. We're then creating a new menu called the file menu, and we're gonna cascade that. Uh, and what that means is we're gonna create, a f we're gonna create, we're gonna create like options inside a menu. That's what we're trying to do here. So we're saying menu.cascade. We're creating over here a file, the file option. And then when menu, so menu menu is the bar, right? So menu is this bar over here. And what we're trying to say over here is we're trying to create over here a new file menu. Over here. Here's the new file menu. We're saying over here menu.cascade. And we want to add over here is a new. What we want to say over here. So we're trying to add over here a file, then we're trying to add over here the new over here. But over here in this menu cascade, what we're trying to say is we're going to create the file, and we're going to say that the that the uh, we're going to add this file onto the file menu, and that's what we're trying to say over here. We're trying to say over here menu equals file menu. So we add the command new, but of course that does nothing. We're going to have to add commands. So we're going to have to add similar to here where we say menu equals file menu, but we're going to have to we have to add some function, some functionality to what to what this new means, because the computer has no idea what it means. But before we do that, let's add some more stuff to this menu. So what else we're going to add is we're going to add this in open. So we're going to say open, and we can just copy and paste like this. We're going to have it as a save. So we have new, open, and save. We we'll then it, we uh, we can then add in, is a separator. So that's what we're going to do. We're gonna You'll see how that looks. Oh, it's not high bar separator. 
uh, we then also want to add is an exit. And I'm sure that's just what we need. I don't think there is anything else we need. I say need a print. Oh, we'll do that. We'll actually we'll add that in now. But well, we'll only need that later, really. So we'll add that in now. Print. Uh, so if we go to F5 this. File we've got here, new, open, save, print, and you can see there's a separator over here. That line. It's different to the top line. And if you press on the top line, it does, the, it does this. You can, have it. you can move the option somewhere else. So it's cool. Uh, let's add some, let's add, let's add a help. Since the notepad also has a help, let's add our own help. Yeah. Over here, help menu uh, equals so equals menu. Try to add over here. Now, uh, what's different over here is we're now saying over here menu equals menu. I place it in the menu, not place in the root, because we're trying to create a menu inside the menu bar. The menu bar is the one that goes into the root, and then we're trying to create is a new menu inside that menu bar. So that's what we're trying to say over here. Uh, menu dot add cascade. I'm going to try to see over here. Enable equals help. And I'm going to also add is a, a about as well. So these are the options available. Well, these are the menu options uh, so far. Now we do have to add is uh, we are going to have to add is a few functions to be able to deal with some of this stuff, such as the new open and save print. But that'll be uh, that'll be for next video. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. And if you want to see more of these videos, subscribe, and you'll be notified of the next video in this series. Take care.